Why does she look like a Karen who's waiting to see the manager? Because her copy is cold! Hey guys, this is Amy Lee, and welcome to a brand new series of one of my most favorite games ever, Raft. And I cannot wait to get started, so let's get on with it. Come along, Karen! <laughs> And here we are stranded in the big blue sea and luckily look we're on a little raft already now if you've never played raft before you're probably wondering amy darling what are you doing on a teeny tiny raft in the middle of the ocean and to be honest with you i have no idea did i survive an airplane crash who knows but what i do know is we need to grab all of these floating materials in order to survive oh sharky oh it's clive oh clive i mean where do these names even come from in my imagination? I don't even know. But yeah, we will be surrounded by Karen eating sharkies, so we gotta be careful. Now, if you are an OG Amy Lee fan, then you would know that I have played and recorded this game quite a lot, but I never really dedicated myself to it because I got distracted with like Minecraft and Roblox and The Sims. But I am ready now to complete this ocean survival. So all of these items that are drifting by are going to help us to survive. With them, we can learn how to catch and cook some food, to make some weapons, and hopefully get rescued. The developers of Raft update this game pretty regularly, so who knows what has been added since the last time I played. Now looking on the menu, the first thing that we need to build is a building hammer. And to do that, we need lots of planks and we need some rope. In order to make the rope, we need lots of palm leaves, which luckily we have plenty of. So let's craft our hammer. Look, Dad, I did it! I made a hammer! Aren't I a good little Karen? Oh, look, a big boy barrel! I love these. They're like Kinder Surprise eggs. Look at all of the stuff I got in that one. Now we've got our hammer, we can expand our raft a little. Oh, another big boy barrel! I wonder what's in this one. Loves it. Loads of awesome stuff. Ooh, and there is an island right on ahead. I wonder if we can stop and explore it. So now we've got our building hammer sorted. The next thing we need to do is concentrate on food and water. You can see in the bottom left-hand corner that we have some little levels. We have have our thirst, our hunger, and our general health. Ah, Clive! Ah, no, stay away! I attack you with my hooky! That does nothing. Stay away, Clive! You're destroying my raft! Oh my goodness, I slaved away all day making that corner! Oh, criminy, we forgot about the island, too. Ugh, Clive is so very rude. So anyway, as I was saying, we need to concentrate on food and water, and check it out, we can already make ourselves a simple water purifier. Now let's place that right about here. Okay, we just need a little bit more plastic in order to make ourselves a plastic cup so we can collect the seawater and purify it. Oh, and we got it! And now let's craft that cup. So let's scoop up this salt water and pop it here and then we need to place a plank in our water purifier and there it goes! Check it out! That is awesome! So now we've got a steady supply of water. The next thing we need to do is think about food. Oh, and look, I just caught a potato. Now, with that potato, we can, of course, grow more. But I'm thinking we should probably make ourselves a fishing rod. And to do that, we need more rope. And how much rope do we have? I can make a little bit more, but we do need to collect some more palm leaves. Oh, man, the sun is setting. It sure is going to be scary out here at nighttime. Ah, oh, look at that big boy barrel. Gave me exactly what I needed. Now, let's make that fishing rod. Oh, my goodness. It's so dark. It's so super spooky out here wait a minute what if there are ghost sharkies that definitely doesn't sound like fun Ooh, but we can drink our water so let's go ahead and do that mm, so refreshing oh no our little hook thing broke okay let's make a new one Let's expand our raft just a little bit. Oh, I could just do one. Fair enough. Just a few more planks of wood and we can make ourselves a simple grill. Then we'll be able to cook any fish we catch. Ah, no! Clive, stop! I just made that little piece of raft! Stop, Clive! Get away! This hook does nothing, darn it! Ugh, that Clive sure is annoying. Anyway, let's go ahead and make our simple grill and let's pop that right next to our water purifier. Now let's go fish and hope we catch some fishies. Oh, look, I got a raw mackerel. All right, Mr. Mackerel, on the grill you go. Now, I know I'm a vegetarian, you guys, and you're probably going to complain in the comments down below, but obviously I need to survive, and the potatoes 
and beads that I have in my inventory just won't keep me going for long. Plus, I need them in order to grow more. So I'm gonna have to live on a diet of fishies. That is, until I can make lots and lots of potatoes. I caught an old shoe! Look at it! Why is it even here? I don't know, but I dig it. And you know what else? Check it! There is an island right on ahead. And I'm thinking if we make a paddle, we might be able to get on over there. We just need more plastic and more rope. And I got it! Now let's see if we can scoop our way over there. And we've almost made it, but you know what? I think we're gonna need to make an anchor. And we've got enough materials, let's do it. Oh, I'm really struggling getting any closer to this island, you guys. No, I fell off, Clive! Stop! Stay away! Okay, let's go ahead and pop our anchor here. And let's go ahead and pop it down. And there goes the anchor. Ah, there goes Clive! No! Oh, and we made it onto a verge. Oh, it's so pretty, I dig it. Talking of digging it, if we want to get any wood, we need a stone axe. But we need more planks, more stones, and more rope to do that. Now, luckily, we got loads of palm leaves. So let's go ahead and make lots of rope. And look, there's a big boy barrel over there. Do you think we can get it before Clive gets us? I guess. Only one way to find out. Now, let's go for it. Okay, I'm scared. I'm so super scared. Okay, no sign of Clive just yet. Alrighty then. We got the barrel. There's another little piece of plastic here. So let's grab that. Is there anything else? within reach no i don't think so darn it we still can't make the axe we need more stones but wait a minute i think we can use the hook here and pick up some materials we've got clay but which ones are stones hmm i'm not sure but let's see what else we can find oh do you think this is stone i don't know but it sure is causing some dust oh look we got some metal ore that's great look how pretty it is down there but still no stone i bet it's literally like right in front of me but i just can't see it talking of i sure am getting hungry let's catch ourselves some more fish awesome i just got four more fish now what i'm thinking is maybe i should swim out to get some of those big boy barrels that i can see over there but be before I do that, let's head back to the raft and cook up these fish. Ah, 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 Clive, no, you naughty little fishy. That was like so very rude. Here I am trying to survive and you try to kill me on camera. Anyway, let's cook these mackerel. What we need to do is make this wooden spear to protect ourselves, but we need more wood for that. Alrighty then, our mackerel is done, so let's go ahead and eat that. And now let's go for those big boy barrels. Ah, Clive, stop! Stop being mean! Ah, Clive, no, quit it! Stop it! Oh my goodness, he's gonna kill me! Oh, look at my health! Okay, we gotta swim back to the raft. We have no choice, you guys. Come on, come on, we can do it! We are so super close! Oh, dude, are you kidding me? Karen, how did you perish on episode one? Ugh, but at least we respawn with all of our stuff. Ah, oh, man, but you know what's annoying? We still don't have enough wood for our spear. Which also means I see you, Clive. Wait, please don't come over here. No, 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 no. Build a thing. Build a thing. Oh, I built a thing. Which has given me even less wood. But as I was saying, it means we still haven't got enough wood to make an axe to chop down the trees in order to get more wood. But once my health is back up, I think I'm going to go back for those barrels. In the meantime, we can keep on purifying water. And catching some fish isn't a bad idea. And my fishing rod just broke, which is really annoying. And look how dark it is again, you guys. This is so spooky. But you know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna go for those barrels. Ah! <laughs> I have faith. I have faith. Okay, I just got bit again, but there are like three barrels right on ahead, so I got a good feeling about it. What did we get? Oh, stop! What did we get in the first one? Oh, I got like a receiver. That's great, but can you get away from me? There we go. Loves it. All right, now let's go ahead and collect the other barrels. Great. Darn it, Clive! Why do you have to be so rude? And I'm still two planks short of what I need for that wooden spear. Ah, oh, man. Clive, no, stop! Oh my goodness, you are so mean to me! I hate this shark. One of these days, I'm gonna make sushi out of you, mister. I guess I might as well just wait until it's daytime. That way I might see if there's materials floating on by. Twelve seconds later. Nope, I got bored! I'm sure I saw some, like, stuff floating by here. Yes, look! There's 
There's wood! We need the wood! Ah, okay, Clive is on me. He knows I'm around here, but I've done it now. I've set myself a mission. Let's get this bit of plastic. And oh, Clive! Wait a minute, if he does, like, kill me... I will respawn back on the raft, so I guess it's not really a bad thing. I mean, I don't want to die, but hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. Oh my goodness, look at my health bar. This is so super close. Okay, just get on this island. Oh, we did it. And check it, we can now make a wooden spear, so at least we can defend ourselves a little bit. But we still need some stone. And wait, what is this? This looks like a... It is, it's a watermelon. Awesome. Oh, isn't that so very pretty? I'm on top of the island, you guys. Check it and look at this wonderful view. I guess we're not really going to have much luck on this island. So why don't we get back on our raft and carry on floating and gather more wood that way. That way, the next island we come across will be a little bit more prepared. Ah! Now let's remove our anchor and get on our way. Farewell, little island. Hey, Clive, quit it! No, stop destroying my raft! This is like my house! Ha! <laughs> Got it! I scared you off. Ah, oh, darn it, looks like my hook doesn't have long to live, does it? And nope, it just perished. So let's go ahead and make ourselves a new one. Oh, look, three big boy barrels right on the head. And in this one, yes, look, we got some stone. Now that should mean we can make ourselves that axe. And did it! Now let's work on expanding this raft a little. Oh dude, I didn't even realize our fishing rod had broke, but we are out of room in our inventory. Hmm, so that means we're gonna need to make some kind of storage chest. But to do that, we need more plastic. Oh, there's plastic right there, come back! That's it, swim on by, Clive. You're not welcome here, boy. Ah, Clive, no, stay away from my corner, stay away! Alrighty then, now we can make a storage storage chest. And there it is! Isn't it fancy? I dig it. Alrighty then, let's go ahead and place some goodies away. And there we go. Awesome. Well, I think that's all the time we have for this episode, you guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode muchly. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Also, check out www.amily33.co.uk for some wicked cool official Emily merchandise. I love you guys muchly and I'll see ya in the next episode. Good.